town and ancient settlement of Abernethy is situated about eight miles southeast of Perth in Scotland. Its name is derived from the Celtic words Aber, meaning ford, and Nethy, the name of the river on which it stands. Its famous round tower, one of only two such Celtic towers remaining, the other being in Brechin, stands in the churchyard in the middle of the town. Abernethy was once a religious and political centre for the Picts. It was home to a Columban monastery in the 6th century and a Pictish cathedral founded by King Nechtan in the early 700s. There are also remains of a petrified hill fort on the outskirts of the village as well as that of a Pictish fort. The site of a Roman camp is nearby in the river valley. The village has played an important role in Scottish history, including the Treaty of Abernethy signed between King Malcolm III of Scotland and William the Conqueror in 1072. That is the same William the Conqueror that invaded England six years earlier in 1066. Abernethy Tower dates probably from the 9th or 10th century, with 11th century alterations. It is 72 feet high and only 8 feet in interior diameter, with walls 3.5 feet thick. These round towers served the Celtic clergy as steeples and watchtowers against the Viking invaders. There are still 76 of them standing in Ireland. The original purpose of the Abernethy Tower was defence, but later it was used as a belfry and a beacon. The entrance to the tower lies within Abernethy Churchyard. The tower door is accessed up a short flight of wooden steps and is normally locked. The key can be borrowed from either the Caldees Tea Room, a few yards away from the tower across School Wind, or from the Museum of Abernethy, which can be found a short distance north, again along School Wind. A Pictish symbol stone found in the village has been placed at the side of the tower. It probably dates back to some time around 600. 